Yo guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing and telling you guys what each berry in Pokemon Go does. So if you guys do not know, there is five different types of berries in the game at the moment in time. There is a raspberry, a nanat berry, a pinup berry, a golden raspberry, and a silver pinup. Uh, these all have their own sort of like um, reasoning and meaning to be in the game. And today we're just going to be going through breaking down a very simple video, but it just allows you guys to really know what to do when you're in that situation. So guys, to start off with the raspberry. So the raspberry in Pokemon Go is just like a purple berry. It would, there will be a picture of the berry on screen. Um, and what this does is it allows you, it increases your chance of catching the Pokemon by 1.5 times so it, this is a very good thing to do if there's a pokemon out there which you really want to catch for example a dino they're quite rare and noy bat or anything which is rare or you need for your pokedex a um normal raspberry is the best way to go forward the next berry we have is the pinup berry so guys what the pinup berry does is when you use a pinup berry if you catch the pokemon on the next throw this will allow you to get two times the amount of candy from catching a pokemon so for example you're out there and let's just say it's a magic carp and you need you know the gyarados as soon as possible the pinup berry will be your way forward um instead of getting your three times candy you uh, the free candy you'll get the six candy but this has to be on your next throw if you do not get it on your next throw you will have to use another pinup berry to get the two times candy the nanat berry is what we have next and what the nanat berry does is pretty straightforward so you know how sometimes you are trying to catch a pokemon and it's moving around the screen from left to right or it's like a ghastly and it moves up and down up and down like a magnemite um use a nanat berry and this will stop the pokemon from moving making the catch easier to get or easier throw um but yeah guys that's the nanat berry so guys, the next berry we have is a silver pinup berry. What this does is it gives you 2.3 times the amount of candy, the catch candy, as long as you catch it on your next throw. But this also allows you to have a 1.8 times increase on catching it. So it's pretty much like the raspberry and the pinup berry made into one. So this is very good for uh, them harder to catch Pokemon. So if you guys don't know, if you catch a second stage or third stage Pokemon, you will get bonus candy. Um, I think it's like 10 candy for the final ev ev evolution so for example if you was to catch a charizard you will get 10 candy use a silver pinup berry you will get 20 candy and it will allow you to get the catch a lot easier so yeah guys that's a silver pinup so guys the last berry we have is the golden raz this allows you to catch a pokemon a much greater rate for example it's like the raspberry which gives you 1.5 but the golden raz will give you a 2.5 times of catching the Pokemon. So if you guys do not know, when you do legendary raids, you are rewarded with golden raspberries or any sort of raid. Um, make sure you are using your golden raspberries when it comes to catching the legendary Pokemon. Uh, but also if you find a very, very rare Pokemon like a Tyranitar out in the wild, if you really want it, use the golden raz. As like I said, it gives you a 2.5 times catch great success so for example it will boost your chances by 2.5 times which makes it very very useful for when you are trying to get them harder and more rarer pokemon so guys this is just a very simple video it's just giving you guys a bit more detail on how the berries are and what their rates are and what they do within the game um i do know that pokemon go give you a brief description of what the berries do but this is a more in depth look for example i'm telling you what uh the how the raspberry helps like a 1.5 times how the golden raz helps like a 2.5 times how the silver pin up works is just a 1.8 times of a more of a successful rate so you guys know when you're in them situations with the rare or legendary pokemon what your best odds are um a last thing i'm going to say is if you manage to get a shiny legendary pokemon from a raid this is a guaranteed catch so in my opinion i use a pin up or a silver pin up in these situations to make myself get that bonus candy but guys thank you for watching i hope you have a good day and without further ado stay shiny hunting peace whenever your heart is broken